Give me your pardon, sir. I have done you wrong, but pardon as you were a gentleman. This presence knows, and you must needs have heard, how I am punished with a sore distraction. What I have done, that by that might your nature, honor, and exception, roughly awaken, I here proclaim, was madness. Was Hamlet wrong? Laity? Never Hamlet. If Hamlet from himself be taken away, and when he is not himself does wrong, Laity, then Hamlet does it not. Hamlet denies it. If be so, Hamlet is of a faction that is wrong. His madness is poor, his en Hamlet's enemy. Sir, in this audience, let my disclaiming from a purpose evil free me so far in your most generous thoughts that I have shot my arrow or the house and harmed my brother. This scene, Hamlet is delivering an apology to Laertes. He starts off his apologize, apology by expressing how awful he feels for everything that he has done to him and his family. He goes on to explain that it was his madness or mental illness that drove him to do these awful acts. The awful acts being accidentally killing Polonius, his father, and indirectly causing Ophelia's death, his sister. It says on lines 212 and 218, what I have done, that might by your nature, honor, expectation, roughly awaken, I here proclaim, was madness. Hamlet ends the speech by saying that he feels Laerthe's empathy and that he is genuinely sorry for bringing so much pain to someone that he considers his brother. He expresses this on lines 225 to 228, letting my discussion. Claiming from a purposed evil, free me so far in your most generous thoughts that I have shot my arrow or the house and hurt my brother. This demonstrates how, La how Hamlet truly sees Laertes as his own brother. Hamlet apologizes in front of everyone during a ceremony. Gertrude, his mother, tells him to do this. But this is a big deal because it really shows us how Hamlet is truly sincere about his apology to Laertes. In addition, Hamlet feels Laertes' pain and knows how he's feeling. Moreover, this is the first time in the play that Hamlet admits he's guilty. Although Hamlet is on a journey for justice and revenge for his father's death, he ends up committing a murder and indirectly is responsible for Ophelia's death. By apologizing, Hamlet shows us that he continues to be a man of justice even when the matter does not affect his own father. Hamlet continues to make, try to make things right and accept his re responsibility for his actions. This apology is important because it allows the reader or viewer to know how Hamlet truly feels about what he has done. It also sets the scene for the rest of the play. It allows us to know how both Hamlet and Laertes feel before the fighting scene. We know that Hamley's, Hamlet's apology is sincere and genuine, but Laertes' apology is a lie, but Hamlet is fooled by this fake apology, demonstrating dramatic irony. Although Laertes and Hamlet both apologize to each other, he still wants a full investigation on Hamlet. In conclusion, this scene has dramatic significance because it sets the scene for the rest of the play. It allows us to know how Hamlet feels before he dies. Hamlet and Laertes' speeches can, or apologies can be used to compare and contrast considering that they are both foils to each other. We can see how both act differently in the same situation or how they handle things differently.